At least 11 people have died after styrene gas leaked from the LG Polymers factory in the city of Visakhapatnam. Although it is feared a death toll will rise. Getty Images BuzzFeed News has reporters across five continents bringing you trustworthy stories about the impact of the coronavirus. To help keep this news free, become a member and sign up for our newsletter. Outbreak Today, New Delhi. Hundreds of people have been taken to hospital after a styrene gas leak at a chemical factory in Southeast India. At least 11 people have died after the leak took place in the middle of the night in the city of Visakhapatnam, Andhra Pradesh state. Although the death toll is expected to rise, more than 1,000 people are thought to be ill as a result of the incident. Getty Images people gather in front of the LG Polymers plant following the gas leak. Operations at the South Korean-owned LG Polymers factory were only just resuming due to coronavirus-related restrictions in place since March. A spokesperson confirmed from Seoul that a security guard discovered the leak overnight. Getty Images rescuers evacuate people following the gas leak. Styrene is a gas that is used to make plastics and rubber. Extremely distressing pictures and videos of people struggling to breathe and collapsing on sidewalks have been posted online. Several showed limp bodies of adults and children being loaded into cars in ambulances. Primary report is PVC gas or styrene leaked from LG polymers. Bepi Gunter near Gopalapetnam in Visakhapetnam at around 2.30 a.m. today because of the leakage of the said compound gas hundreds of people have inhaled it and either fell unconscious or having breathing issues. Precautionary measures for gas leak accident The Director General of India's National Disaster Response Force told broadcaster NDTV that people admitted to the hospital were semi-conscious showing signs of nausea and skin irritation. Watch, as of now. The gas leakage has stopped but a lot of people have been hospitalized and are in a semi-unconscious state. Many of them are facing breathing problems. Skin irritation. SN Pradhan. DG. NDRF. Hashtag Visa Gas Leak. According to the app, an eight-year-old girl was among those who died as well as a person who died falling into a well while trying to escape the gas. A member of the state police has told Half Post India that at least 70 people are in critical condition in different hospitals, while the Director General of Police said that 20 people are on ventilators. We are currently assessing the extent of the damage on residents in the town and are taking all necessary measures to protect residents and employees in collaboration with related organizations. LG Chem, the owner of LG Polymers, said in a statement. Another representative from LG Polymers told the state's chief minister that in order for casualties to decrease, emissions would have to come to zero, which had not happened yet. GVMC officials blowing water through mist blowers to subside the effect of sirene gas leak at Gopalapatnam area of Visakhapatnam. An official from the state of Gujarat said that 500 kilograms of another chemical that was likely to neutralize the gas leakage was being airlifted to the chemical plant. After request of Andhra Pradesh Chief Minister Atis Jagan, Gujarat Chief Minister at VJ Rupani BJP gives orders to chemical companies in Vapi to send PTBL chemical by road to Dharman for airlift. Ashwani Kumar, Secretary to Hashtag Gujarat Chief Minister Hash TV9 News. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has said he had spoken to officials from the Federal Home Ministry and the National Disaster Management Authority who were monitoring the crisis, spoke to officials of MHA and NDMA regarding the situation in Visakhapatnam, which is being monitored closely. I pray for everyone's safety and well-being in Visakhapatnam.
India's National Human Rights Commission has also taken notice of fatalities as a result of the leak and asked the state's officials to conduct an investigation. If you like this video, please hit like and subscribe to Tom Snout. Have a nice day.